we have been at it for three months. And at the end of it all, dynasty meets dynasty. Call it boiling point or call it freezing point, this is the point of no return as champion meets champion to become the ultimate champion. Manning of Victor's Jamaica College against the Costa Cup winners Clarendon College in a battle for the Olivia Shield at the Mecca of Jamaica's football. Unconscionable if seasonal goals weren't met. Reprehensible if they hadn't got this far. But the journeys of these institutions to this moment couldn't have been more different. CC cruised, JC bruised. The varied stories of ultimate champions meeting to decide all island schoolboy football supremacy in the island of Jamaica. is free, plays it across, it's gone in! A close up off the bench, puts it across the line for Jamaica College. Shield, of course, a We spoke about the players coming off the bench or the quality of the that you can call up off the bench. Both teams making positive changes, but he scuffed the shot. But in the end, it worked in his favor. And having Smith going the other way, his intention was to play to the far side. And though it didn't make a clean connection, you felt had he done so, might have gone around the post or hitting it. But just trickled across the line, and Smith. He's begging for everything, offside or whatever he could get, and there was no reprieve coming. Free kick, Clarendon College. JC, they were sharp, but they have to defend this corner kick. It's the last play of the game, I think. And they have to move quickly. I think they, they shouldn't be looking for a short corner here. 21 players. 20 players inside the boxes. This one is sent inside the area. The keeper drops it and Prince Daniel Smith puts it across the line in dramatic fashion. CC level as Daniel Russell is beaten by his opposing number. And the Costa Cup champions, they send this into penalty shootout. Prince Daniel Smith, my word, it's 1-1. When he stayed up for it and he was up there for a long time, tried to get a shot off earlier, scuffed it, almost ended up into an assist. But in the end, it was Russell who gave him the opportunity. A regulation take you felt by the goalkeeper. And once he dropped it, it was Smith who was quickest to react. And with all the efforts on the goal line from Murray, couldn't stop that one. Spooned off him, but Smith staying up and showing good work for doing so. Took the chance, Smith. And my word, you said he was an outfield player, Donald. A left back. Well, in the modern game, the left backs or the wing backs, they score a lot. And in this that occasion, he showed all that quality. Another player who had a good game today, Richard Thompson. He's now trying to make it two from three. Thompson steps up to shoot. Oh, he skies it! It's a horrible kick! And Richard Thompson cannot believe it. Always oh, leaning back again, similar to the earlier miss we saw from Jamaica College and from a team that looks so composed from 12 yards in the Manning Cup finals certainly look ragged here and you feel that's uh, the Olivia Shield God. Andre Nicholson has the responsibility to win the Olivia Shield again for Clarendon College. Was that the kiss of life? He did it last year with a magnificent effort from outside the box. 
He just now needs to score from 12 yards away and does! Andre Nicholson has done it again! In the big moments, he comes up trumps and Clarendon College, they celebrate another Olivia Shield title! Chapleton celebrates once again. 